I'm Boomer Esiason for SI.com. And next week coming will be a new MLB commissioner to replace longstanding Bud Selig as the new commissioner of Major League Baseball. There are many good candidates, but the one that I would select would be Rob Manfred. Now, Rob Manfred, and many of you probably have read, has been pretty much the voice for Major League Baseball throughout its scandals here the last few years, especially with Biogenesis and Alex Rodriguez and everything else. He's been Bud Selig's right-hand man for about 15 years. He knows the inner workings, and he's also a part of the Labor Relations Committee side for the owners. He also understands TV contracts. And the one thing that I would say to him that I would like to see, and I know the players are going to hate this, I would love to see some sort of salary cap in Major League Baseball. Now, I know there's a luxury tax, and I know teams push up against it, and I know teams like the Dodgers and the Yankees and other high-spending teams have supported teams like the Pirates and the Astros, whose owners don't spend any money. But with a salary cap comes a minimum that each team would be required to spend. Just look at the NHL. The fact of the matter is, I think there is a major disparity in Major League Baseball, and that's that the big market clubs always seem to dominate. And every now and then, you might get a small market club and make a little bit of a run. But really, in this day and age, to spend less than $125 million and make it to the playoffs and win the World Series, it's not the norm. Certainly, that would be something that I would look into, but I know the players will never allow that to happen. A man can dream, I guess. And I guess that's where you sit if you are a Met fan like I am. You just hope that someday they're going to turn the corner. I'm Boomer Esiason for SI.com.